Hey True Clan members, it's me, Monkey Chicken here, and uh, the topic of today's video is Battlefield Hardline, my opinions on it and whatnot. And uh, with that, let's go and begin. So if you guys don't know, the next Battlefield is going to be called Battlefield Hardline, and it's basically local police force versus criminals, and it's pretty cool. Well, those are the main uh, factions. I, I originally said cops and robbers, but people said, no, that's not the game mode, this is game mode, but I'm not really trying to talk about the, the game mode or game modes that are going to be in there. I'm trying to talk about the, the two opposing forces that are in there, and that's what it is, local police force versus criminals. And uh, we really won't get too much into the game modes beyond that there's ones that's called the heist where basically, you know, you get some money or a valuable amount of money and you run it to your thing and then you try to collect it. And there's one called blood money. And uh, I'll try to do this really quickly because I really don't want to get too much into it. Uh, there's two money trucks or vaults, whatever you want to call them. In the game, they're called vaults. Me personally, I like to call them money trucks because they're trucks and you put money in them. Uh, <laughs> so... Um, on each spawn or you know on each side there's uh, two money trucks in the middle there's a thing called money piles so you go up to these money piles you collect the money and then you drop it off to opposing trucks and you can run to your enemy truck steal their money that they put into their truck and take it back to your truck and you know the bar goes up and down and that kind of stuff but uh, yeah without getting into the objectives too much and telling you oh, this is what you need to do let's go and talk about some of the guns the gunplay and uh, the way it kind of works around. And uh, the first thing I want to say is, if you guys don't know, as far as I'm aware of, there is no tanks. The real enemy that's in the game right now uh, for vehicles, because for me, that's my one thing that I don't like about. Uh, that's the one thing I don't like about Battlefield is uh, the vehicles themselves. And uh, the one thing that kind of gets you is the helicopters. And the helicopters aren't too bad as long as you're indoors and you kind of avoid them and whatnot. But since I like to play the sniper, I'm usually on ledges and rooftops and stuff. So it's one of those things. But I'm an aggressive sniper, so usually I sit near um, objectives and push people and whatnot. But anyways, um, the snipers themselves and the, the guns that I have used are all pretty good. They're pretty, uh, they're pretty decent. I think I'm level 8 or so into the beta. Um, I think I'm pretty far decent along. I've played about like eight hours into it or so. I've played quite a few amount of matches. And uh, I'm loving it so far. I love all the new gadgets they got. They got things called grappling hooks where you can you know, throw them onto walls and then climb up them. Uh, they got, I'm trying to remember exactly what it's called, the good zip lines where you can shoot them into buildings. And uh, you know, obviously the ones that are below you and you zip line into the building. And you can use it for uh, quick accesses. Like, for instance, when you're doing blood money, you can shoot it from one building to the other after, you know, from the money pile this way, boom, you get your money, run, zip line, boom, all the way to your truck. Obviously not right into it, because usually they're a little bit hidden, but it's a shortcut. And it's actually pretty good. Uh, it gets you point A to point B pretty quickly. When I originally seen these things, I thought they were gonna be jokes, but since the player gets to set them up themselves and you actually move pretty quickly on the zip line, uh, they're pretty damn helpful. They're pretty damn helpful. I thought they were going to be jokes. It'd be like, oh man, people who use zip lines are noobs, but I actually use them quite often and they're actually pretty damn helpful. So, yeah, pretty good. Uh, the camera, I've only just unlocked and started using, so I really don't know what they do. There's a few other things. Um, there's one called like the decoy where it looks like a bunch of speakers and it's supposed to like project someone on the mini map of the enemy and then like it makes gun sounds for them this way. They're like, oh, where is he? But since I since you can't really set up a private match and you know ask your buddy what do you see and look at this footage and stuff, it's a little bit complicated. But um, so far it's a pretty cool game. I'm liking it. I might actually get this one um, probably first day. I'll probably go pre-order because this one actually really has my attention. I really like the way it's going with it. I love the fact that there's no tanks. As far as I'm aware of the game modes that I have played, um, so I've only been really playing Blood Money. Um, I like and I like the buildings now um, because originally when you get to buildings like you're not able to get all the way to the top You're only able to go midway But in all the buildings that you see around the map that are really tall You're able to go onto roofs without having to get a fucking helicopter So if you don't know how to pilot one, you know, you really don't need too much skill You just get there then it's um, elevators up and then you usually take some kind of steering system then again a steering system and Yeah, you're onto the top of the one and you know once you're up there You can zip line to one or the other and get to a different building So it's actually pretty cool. So if you're like, oh my god, I'm under fire Oh, no, trying to get off this building zip line boom, and then you're out to another building So it's pretty cool. Although you really can't go back and forth because once again you go from one uh, Point that's higher to a lower point. So yeah, it's actually pretty cool I really like it. I'm having tons of fun playing it uh, once again. I have like eight hours into it but uh, I want to know your guys' favorite point. For me, I still love sniping. It's so much fun. Um, the trick mine lasers, I if you guys don't know, there's um, as far as I'm aware, there's no regular mines. So you got these laser mines that you're able to stick onto like walls and stuff. And it's it's pretty freaking crazy. It's it's cool. I've died by them. I don't know if I've killed anyone with them. I'm still trying to get the hang of them. But yeah, you can't just like look down and set it down on the ground because it's a laser. They got to pass through laser, then boom. But 
yeah, it's pretty cool. Anyways, guys, I want to know what your favorite part is. Once again, mine's a sniper because I love sniper rifles. But, yeah, gonna end it there. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. I'm Mugging. So, yeah, guys. Peace.